news, my lovely, wonderful people. Not be smart, it all they happen so. So, APC now does send message to Nigerians, even send message to court. Third court say, what do you think is happening? What is going on? Uh, it asks court, say, whether will it be right to remove Tinubu? That Tinubu is already going abroad to represent the country. Okay, he's already doing everything to represent the country, to do different things. Say, so, will it be right? Will it be right at all? Okay, for them to now remove him. How do they want Nigeria to be seen? That since he has already started representing the country, they should allow sleeping dogs to lie. And you, you know, just wait for 2027 that this cannot continue. You know, you cannot continue with this. This cannot continue to happen. That it is important people begin to, to see things the way they should be. And that Nigerians should please accept what is going on and do not, uh, you know, do not rock, rock the ship you know or the boats that you know how we the international world see nigeria please don't forget to give us a thumbs up like or share subscribe thank you breaking news tinubu is already going abroad to represent the country how are you going to remove him now does that speak well of the country does that say nigeria will become become the country it should be how do we sort this out dr tukumbo Percy, a uh, chieftain of the People Democratic Party and former governorship candidate of the Social Democratic Party, SDP, in 2019. And also APC members have shared their thoughts on the ongoing case at the Presidential Election Petition Tribunal. Concerning the fate of his, of his party, PDP, and what is going on with the decision of the Presidential Election Tribunal. In 2019, presidential election, governor of Lagos State and national leader of the All Progressive Congress, APC, Ashiwaju Ahmed Bola Tinubu, emerged as the winner. Then, you know, um, defeating the strong candidates, including Peter Ubi of Labour Party and Alaji Atiku Abubaka of the People's Democratic Party. And Ruby, you know, Musa, Rabbi Musa Konkos of the New Nigerian People Party. Currently, the presidential candidate of the Labour Party, Peter Obi, and that of the People Democratic Party, Alaji Atiku Abubakar, are challenging the victory of Bola Ahmed Tinubu in the presidential election tribunal. The tribunal commenced a sitting, currently sitting a few weeks, and I've been he hearing the case being presented with evidences and facts before the courts. In a recent interview reported by The Punch, Dr. Tokumbo expressed his thoughts on all of this. He expressed his thoughts on the ongoing issue, stating that he prayed to God that the court would do the right thing. However, he admitted, he admitted that in the very face of the current event, how do you sort this out? How? stating that he prayed that God will help us to do the right thing. He admitted that it's not hopeful for any very good thing to come out of this. I said because currently Tinubu is going abroad to represent the country. He's been seen as Nigerian's president and a lot is hinged on this. So many matters are going on with what is currently happening today. A lot of people are beginning to wonder what really is happening. Ashiwaju Ahmed Bola Tinubu has now become the chairman of ECOWAS, and many more is happening. How do you sort this out? Just how do you sort this out? So this is what is going on right now. And every single person is beginning to wonder and ask themselves, how did we get here in the first place? The issue has become a serious one, and nobody should sit back there thinking that things are suddenly going to fall in place. Every single individual must rise up and do not allow the same thing to continue ever again. If the tribunal and every single person wants the truth, we will have to take a bold step, and nobody should be allowed to allow these people to continue. If we want the truth, everybody will have to take a bold step and rise up. So this is what is happening currently right now. They say Tinubu is already you know, he's already, you know, uh, representing Nigeria all over. And um, he's been seen as Nigerian's president 
how do we sort this out? How do we, you know, come out of this very current, you know, situation that is ongoing now? What do we need to do? And how do we need to sort it out? Tinubu has already been seen, okay, as Nigerian's president. He's already been seen as Nigerian's president. And every single person understands this. So how is it going to be, okay, that he'll be removed all of a sudden? So these are some of the things that are going on. And Nigerians are beginning to wonder and ask themselves very serious questions if we can continue like this. The issue is if we do not speak out, okay, or speak up, and we continue to allow the same thing to hold on, to hold us down, okay? Okay? We will continue to allow the same thing to hold us down. See the problem that awaits Nigeria today. See the problem that awaits Nigeria today. So nobody, okay? Nobody should allow the same thing to continue. Nobody. Okay? So it is, uh, it is something that we should... Uh, we should do immediately and refuse to allow the same thing to continue. Please don't forget to give us a thumbs up. Like us, share, subscribe. Okay? And we just need to ensure that every single one of us are rising and doing everything humanly speaking possible. Okay? To bring this nation to where it ought to be. If we continue to let the same thing hold us down, we will not be able to apparently get the truth, you know, from a nation where truth has become relative. If we want this country to be better, if we want things to begin to look up, every single individual must, you know, must rise up and every one of us must do what is needed and necessary. Okay? Uh -huh. So it is, it is something of, of, of importance that every one of us must understand this. That the process of getting the nation to be where it needs to be is ongoing. And there will be a lot of challenges. What I'll plead and enjoy with every single one of us is not to be discouraged. We must not be discouraged. We must continue to you know, allow the right thing to be done. We must continue. We must never be discouraged. You know, In that way, we can really get this country to move. Please don't forget to give us a thumbs up, like us, share, subscribe. God bless. Have a fantastic and a lovely day. And from us, it's bye for now.